Hey, this is Marie, Twisted V Minis. We are fixing to head to Fowler Family Farms to pick up Syrup and bring him home and get him friendly. All that fun stuff. Oh my goodness. Hello. Hello, sweetheart. Do you say hello? We're gonna go pick up. Go get back and get Sarah and bring him home. And we have to make him friendly and sweet, just like you, huh? Oh, just like you. Um, well, come along and I hope you guys enjoy. What did I didn't mean to tell you. I didn't mean to tell you. I didn't mean to tell you. What's up? I wonder if that would kiss your nose. No, that was weak that little nose he is. She's so precious. I'm supposed to be going bye-bye, but you're so sweet. And you're so sweet. He's over there eating feathers. You're so silly. So, we are letting the goats out yep. to try yeah. and corral the ponies. Yeah, I think it'd Attempt. be much easier with the goats over here. Yeah. Out of the way. Yes. Now, we'll leave Silas in. Silas, so I don't like to get him out because it's, he's hard to get back in. Okay. But what kind of goats are these? Kiko. 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 I was thinking Kiko. This one right here is my 100%. He's New Zealand. Kiko. Oh, really? Yeah. He's only it's two years pretty. old. That's Chip. It's uh, crazy how much bigger they yeah, get. They get bigger. Mm -hmm. And the rest of these, the rest of these are Kiko percentage goats. Mm -hmm. And I would say like, like Oreo here is probably 75% Kiko. Crybaby is probably 75%. Well, yours are actually coming up to you. Our Kikos weren't that friendly. Wait, did you feed them enough? Hmm? Did you feed them enough? I, I, do you remember who you're talking to here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. We definitely fed them enough. The Billy. Three times. Yeah. Yeah, he's only. Yeah, he'll get huge. He'll yeah. get big. Yeah. Except yeah. That, one there. that one's. That one's only. 16 months old. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, he'll get big. He'll, he'll actually probably be bigger. Bigger. This They're one's cool. New Zealand. Mm -hmm. So he's, he's purebred. Yeah. He's like 100% New Zealand. 100% Kiko. That's the cool. over there is considered a purebred Kiko. Mm-hmm. So his, basically his daddy is New Zealand. And his mama was, was a like purebred a, Kiko. Okay. Like a 92% Kiko. Okay. Cool. All right, cool. Good. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, well. Hello. Okay, I tried. Mm. Hey, you got him. Mm. Hello. Come here, Silas. Come on. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's get you back mm -hmm. in, buddy. Okay, come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Come on, just go, Griffin. Yeah. All right. Now. We know pancake. Pancake's friendly. Yes. Syrup so is like his mama. <laughs> oh my goodness, he's beautiful. He's a really pretty guardian dog. Yeah, I like him a lot. Yeah. I like the other one, not the one that was out. Mm -hmm. I have one up there with all my Dolans. Yeah. Past the the shop up there mm -hmm. is our Doling pen. Oh, cool. We've got eight more goats up there. Oh, they're so happy. Oh, yeah. They love being out. That's awesome. Is it bad by the container I can tell you have the good treats? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Those are the ones that have the good crunch. Yep. Yeah. The nibblers or nay nibblers. Yeah. yeah, those things are awesome. Oh, they love them. Yeah. What I do, though, to, make, to stretch them a little further, mm -hmm. I break them in half or, or oh. four even. Yeah. Yeah, that way, especially if I do. Yeah. The goats like them too. Yes. The goats. Well, hopefully so, we can. That little barrel over there has all of our grain in it. Mm -hmm. you that? You ha oh, we you have the trailers. the trailers. Yeah. yeah. All right. I wanted one of those. They're way too expensive now. Yeah. Should have bought those. Should have bought. We that. bought it a couple we'll years ago. Yeah. Yeah, that's when we bought it. Yeah, and then it's. Very much. Uh oh. What is that? It's a jump gate. A jump gate? For yeah. The dog? For the dog, yeah. Okay. What I was the sitting there and I was like, What is, is it? That a homemade head shoe? No, that's a jump what, gate. what is that? What, okay. How does it, the piece in the middle, like, uh, how does it work? Well, I, was, I was looking at it and I was trying to figure it out. Here, undo this. 
So now I don't use it a whole lot anymore mm -hmm. because our dogs can just get through this and the goats can't. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. But like this, like if I want him, if I want him to be able to use this, now he can jump. Oh, through this. But the cool. Goat, the goats can't because they can't get their. You know, the goats' front legs that is don't so have the same smart. Yeah. Yes. So they can't do what dogs do. So the dogs can just jump through it to get their feed. Makes sense now, because at first I was like, well, that piece comes off, so maybe yeah. he gets some feed right here, and st they stick their head in, and he <laughs> Boom. just... <Yeah. laughs> I mean, you could, you, I guess... That, that's that pretty work. slick. But, uh, but this, uh, the reason that's... Like, if I would have built this a little bit smaller, my goats, most, most of my goats wouldn't be able to put their heads through it. Right. With their horns, but I built it a little bit too big. So normally the opening's not quite this big, right? And they can they can jump through oh, a smaller opening. Better shut this because he, he yeah, knows he knows how knows. to use it. Oh yeah, he's, <laughs> he's actually really good with it. Really? Jenny, or the the dog that's loose. That's pretty cool. Yeah, she doesn't use it at all. Because we have a hard time with the pigs that they our dogs go under the fence, yeah, yeah, and then the pigs can go under, under the fence. Yeah. So we might we might have to try that. Yeah, that works really, really well. I just That's shouldn't cool. have built it. Basically, it's a triangle. Mm -hmm. Do you, it's did you make triangle. a? I yeah. can search your videos. Did you make yeah, a video yeah, on it? A video on that. Okay, just so we shrink can it. shrink <laughs> it a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Now your dogs are pretty big too, so maybe. Right. Mm -hmm. And your goats are shorter, so you may yeah. be able to get away with it. Okay. But these bigger goats, like the Kikos, like the Oreo, will stick her head through it, and then she'll end up getting halfway through it and get stuck and. Okay. I don't want that to be overnight. You know? Yeah. Yeah, and have a. So that's why I put the middle piece in. Okay. All right. So he doesn't like going through that because mm -hmm. it's so small. Yeah. But he'll go through it. He's like, if I have to. Yeah, if I have to. You want out? All right. <laughs> He's like, I didn't really want in there. I was just kidding. Aww. Pancake looks super cute on your videos. And yeah. Rai Rai seems like she... Uh, Rylan loves them. Oh, that's um, good. Rylan's getting to where she actually pets Pancake pretty easily now. She'll actually... You hungry? Come here. Come here. Why are you being shy all of a sudden? Because the dog's around? Aww. So, the horse kicks the dog a lot. Oh, no. So, I'm surprised... Silas is this close. Silas usually gets away. <laughs> yeah. But then our goats ram the horse. Oh, you know, no. Like a circle. <laughs> and then our dog will chase the goats. <laughs> so oh, like, no. Who's, who's really the boss out here? That's funny. Hey, I'm going to try and walk him up a little bit. Yeah. And see if... Two of them ended up getting back in. So we're going to try to push them into this little area. Oh, dang it. Yeah, so close. I wasn't prepared. There's a whole feed trough full of yeah. grain right there. I'm sure Pancake will probably get in there pretty good. Pancake probably be good. Syrup will be like, no. Oh, really? You're that used to me that you mm -hmm. won't even take it from her? Yeah. <laughs> Aww. I was trying to bribe him and make him come in there. You're going to take one from me? You won't take it from her anymore? <laughs> you said, I, I'm no dummy. Yeah. All the way in there. <laughs> Just bribing. Just bribing him, hoping, yeah. hoping for the best. Don't be scared of us. Yeah. There we go. Silas, come here. Now syrup will definitely go in. Because he is on the other side of pancake. Oh. He likes to have pancake between me. Oh, me. okay. So he'll get in there in a minute. I don't have any more snacks. I don't have any. You're so handsome. Yes, you are. It's called the waiting game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sudden movements, you never know. 
Hey, it's called food motivation. Yes. Food motivation is a lot of times the easiest way to go. Yeah. He's like, I'm no dummy. I know the trick. I love how he has a whole herd following him. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's just funny, the whole herd of goats. Such a bad little pony. Run, Mike, run! Yeah. <laughs> so we got syrup caught, and he's has like the death grip on this tree, right down here in his lips. He look at that. He's a hot mess. He's huffing and puffing. But so are we. You'd think you'd be tired. So now I wanted to check out Mike's chicken tractor because one of the things that I noticed is it looked like it was small enough. Yes, it's, that... it's very light, mm -hmm. it's very movable. Uh, Braxton, when he was younger, you know, he's 17 now, but even when he was... Uh, <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm talking about you. You moving the chicken coop. So even when he was younger, he could move this. He <laughs> yeah. could move this with no, no yeah. problems yeah. at all. Okay. Um, it's made out of fi uh, fence pickets. So fence it's pickets. really, okay. yeah, it's, it's designed to be outside. So mm -hmm. you don't have to treat it, you don't have to paint it, nothing. Um, it's a fence, basically, oh, just okay. built in a box. Awesome. So it works good. One thing I would change is this. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me, I'm going to flip it. So what would you change? So one thing I would change is the tarp. The tarp? Yeah, I would either go with a banner type tarp that's a okay. lot thicker and won't mm -hmm. tear up in the wind. Because this just tears up in the wind like crazy. Okay. Or go with those, uh, like kind of like my lean-to is. Your lean-to? It's the uh, panels, but it's the plastic panels, not the oh, metal. Oh, I, I don't see it. Well, so it's kind of like the corrugated metal oh, okay. the panels. The plastic, the plastic so it's panels. lighter yeah. lighter you weight. You can do that across here, and that's still light. Mm -hmm. And then you can make this any height you want. Mm -hmm. I would probably make this a little shorter, actually. A little shorter? Yeah, possibly like, down to here. Because okay. Are you doing meat chickens? I can't remember. Are you doing all your I'm. Chickens? Well, I'm wanting to be able to move them through having a smaller cage where I can move them through my iris because the chickens uh, are great at working the ground, but they're bad at tearing it up. So I'm taller. Though. Okay. Or at least this high, or maybe even taller. Because okay. You're talking about birds that are want to fly anyway. Yeah. My meat, meat birds didn't want to fly. Okay. So there was no reason for me to go quite this tall. Okay. But it's very simple. I mean, this is just a rope mm -hmm. on it. And it doesn't take much to move it. Just one little pull. Okay. It's very light. You do have to, uh, uh oh. <laughs> I found a toy. You have to move your water out of there. Okay. Move your water out. There. How, how'd you like the hanging feeder? Is there anything that you'd change or? No, I love it. It worked good? I'll, I'll do this right here on all of my chicken tractors now. Okay. Yeah, I do. That worked that. really well. And it's just, you can see how it's made. Yeah. PVC. That's awesome. Uh, but yeah, once you move the water out of the way, Cause, it's easy to move. Alright, I'm yeah, going to... Let me video um, and you move it. Because that's the, the biggest problem that I'm having is that stuff is too heavy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I can now, what Tanya does mm -hmm. is she steps in, in the rope. Yeah. No, 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 in the rope. rope. Yeah. Like this? Yeah, and, and now she moves it w around her waist and she oh, just okay. walks. Yeah, that one. Yeah. Good. And, of course, you're going slightly uphill. But, okay. And you still don't have to go, you know, with this much wood. Well, you can make it lighter. That is would be almost like an iris 
That width right there. Yeah, these are these pickets are six feet. Okay. So it's a six by six. Yeah. Well, cool. Yeah, I want something like that. Okay. Well, let let me take you up here to the shop. I love it. She she got William put to work. She wants a little pathway so she can get to her laundry. Okay, so this design here is exactly like the one that's down there that I just showed you. Mm -hmm. It's still the six by six. It's the same height. Uh, okay. But this is the bottom side right here. And my goal is to put, uh, this one's going to be heavier, by the way, but you'll see why. I plan on putting about every 10 inches a, a one by two, okay, and on this side of the panel. Okay. So that the one by two is flush on the bottom. Okay. So it's going to stick up here. And then I'm going to put the half inch mesh wire mm -hmm. you know which, which one I'm talking yeah about? the uh yeah. the little tiny squares little square, yes yeah. a lot of people use it for hardware like mesh yeah, yeah. Hardware mm -hmm. mesh. so i plan on putting that across the whole bottom okay and then on one side or the other i got wheelchair wheels okay mm -hmm. and the, my wheelchair wheels will go like probably a foot in so i'll have uh wheels that i can pull it with and it's going to be that far you know whatever the half height of the wheelchair mm -hmm. is off the ground and then I'll have on the but actually it'll be this side too um it'll have like a kind of like kickstand so mm -hmm. same level as the wheel so the that whole is level. awesome and that way <clears throat> when you when you want to move it there'll be a little bar here you just pick up just barely pick it up and you'll just be able to move it roll it because be that's yeah. been the hardest thing yeah. that I've been realizing is being able to maneuver oh, stuff yeah. Like now, I don't know what this would fit, like chicken wise. Mm -hmm. If they're only in it to sleep, because I plan on. I don't know if you saw my chickens over here. I have that. I haven't seen them over. Them. Oh, okay, we we're gonna have to go look at. All, I want to see all your chickens. <laughs> one fence I, have, mm -hmm. I plan on using that out in my cow pasture to help the flies. Yeah, simple, basically. it's so, it's yeah. awesome yeah, running the chickens and ducks behind them. It's yep. it's. It's insane how well it worked. Do you have? Do you run any ducks or no? No ducks. I don't have. Any. No, I'm gonna have to send you with some this year. Yeah. Because the the great thing with the ducks that I like in the garden is that they don't tear up the plants, whereas the chickens oh, yeah. will. But chickens. the chickens tear up the ground too, which is awesome. And the ducks just pick the bugs off. Yeah. Well, this is awesome because the chickens are so great, but being able to maneuver it has been my problem. Right. It's being so, too heavy. So what, what the goal is with the uh, one by twos here, mm -hmm. that will be their roosting bars. Oh, you know, okay. Have to put roosting bars. They will roost just. I mean, they'll they'll be off the ground, obviously. Because mm -hmm. the wheelchair wheel will bring it up. Yeah. Um, but that'll be their roost. I'm thinking you could probably put. 14 to 18 chickens in it. Cool. Something like that. Well, when That's you get it, do, when so you get it done, I'm going to have to oh, come yeah. wheel it around and see if it's it something that I can, yeah. if I can do it. It will be he heavier, mm -hmm. but it'll be moved. Easier. With the wheels? Yeah, with okay, the wheels cool. Well, awesome. Actually, let me go grab a wheel. And I'll okay, cool. I bought this at Habitat for Humanity. Uh-huh. Uh, they had a wheelchair that was broke. They couldn't sell it. They couldn't, you know, couldn't be used because mm -hmm. the actual chair itself was broke. Right. I was like, well, I'll take it because I, I want the wheels. I'll just tell you that up front. She's like, okay, just give us $5. So I bought them for $5. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah, so we got oh, wow, those are huge. Yes, this, this is perfect. Yeah. Now, I will have to change the actual bolt that's in here. Mm -hmm. Make a, a, a different one. Actually, I don't know. Now, I'm going to have to change that. But mm -hmm. you can see, it'll be off the ground that high. Oh, yeah. From here to here. Uh, that is cool. I can't wait to see it. Oh yeah, this after you. You know what? It never gets flat. Right. Yeah. So it'll, it'll, I think it'll work great. That would be great one, if it does. I haven't is. seen anyone else use it yet. Mm -hmm. I think it'll work. Other people have done similar designs, but not will. They buy these uh, ten-speed tires. Yeah. Ten-speed. Oh, oh, okay. That makes sense. I'm just going to try this to see if it works. It's only five bucks. That's awesome. Putting some use to it. So. Yeah. And keeping it out of the dumpster yep. landfill so that that makes a difference cool i can't wait to see it yeah you may have to wait until spring oh really <laughs> <laughs> i've put this on the back burner oh no no i don't know i, I may try to finish it pretty soon 
Mm -hmm. It's been in this state for about a month. Oh, okay. <laughs> if that tells you anything. Uh, don't worry, I got plenty and, of them projects. I'm making two. See, there's oh, the okay. Yeah, there's the other one. Cool. The, the beginnings. Yeah. Very cool. Well, thanks. Yep. Aw. You can tell they're like, hey. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is cool. They're like, hey, we want to eat. Yeah. I already fed y'all. Y'all want some more? Okay, I'll let Marie video y'all go crazy. She's already seen it. <laughs> Is it on? No, it's actually okay. off right now. Okay. <laughs> when uh, when Rye Rye comes out to play, we usually turn it off. Aww. Where do you, over there is where you feed? Aww. They are all about some snacks. Oh, they love their food. <laughs> those little holes you see right by you? Yeah. They've been taking their dirt baths. Oh, really? Yeah, they just started digging those. This is the, the hangout, these little mm -hmm. holes. I love it when they sunbathe. Oh, yeah, and when they dust and just get themselves all fluffed up useful right here i mean they, they the they get all the you know they never move right the spot. yeah and if they could follow my cows or follow my goats or whatever it's crazy of, of and of and how much bugs they eat mm -hmm. and spreading man, the manure out yeah. and improving your pasture that fast yeah. but i like the cattle panels that you have like can yeah. you move this at all or this isn't yeah, it was right it was right there i have a video on moving this okay but yeah. it's a it's <laughs> it was not good. And that's the problem like yeah. is it gets to be a hassle to move them and yeah. so we so the tractor is so we don't especially yeah. if I can get this one with the wheelchair wheels working. Okay. If I can get that working. It's a game changer, I think. And we cool. Yeah. Have you seen those new ones that are like solar and yeah. and that crazy like yeah. GPS position and yeah. yeah, we're not that high tech, but <laughs> Oh, they're so funny. Uh, these are about six months old, so they should start laying. Really? Now. Probably next spring. These are cool. <laughs> and which one's your rooster? Uh, this one, red one. It's Rhode Island Red Rooster. I've got uh, Barb Rocks, Leggerns, uh, Americanas. Cool. I'm not sure what that one is. The... I don't know what that is. The... Tannish looking tannish? one? It looks like a Americana because of the it's, beard. Okay, it could be. And oh. then these gray ones right here. It look, or the Easter Eggers. Yeah. Uh, like, all the all bearded gray, ones. Those. Are those uh, that, Lavender Orphington? Those are actually called Sapphire Gems. Sapphire Gems. Best oh. egg layers you can get. Really? 330 eggs a year. Oh, wow. And then the Leggerns are supposed to be pretty good, too. They're supposed to be number one or two. Yeah, and I'm surprised that they're, like, an egg chicken, how small the like the leghorns mm -hmm. are. They're not a very big chicken. Mm -hmm. But they are some egg making machines. Egg Ooh, yet. this one's pretty. <clears throat> Trying to show how pretty you are. Yep, nothing in there yet. Hey. Hey girl, hey. <laughs> so I've tried the hot wire before with the strands and have not been successful. Yep. And we were talking about it. And what's your tips on how you got it to work? Well, you have to make sure it's hitting at the very top. It has to be hitting that 8,000 kilovolts. And you got to find that sweet spot where your goat size, mm -hmm. that nose is going to hit first. If yeah. you can get that nose to hit first, they'll never test it again. Like okay. Chip, if I put chip in here, you mm -hmm. won't ever touch it. My, my main buck, he's, he was hit once. He won't even try to get out now. Okay. It, I can keep it off, and he will not even come close to it. Now, some of my other goats, they actually went through it when it was hitting like two to 4,000. Mm -hmm. And that's just like scratching their back. That's is, like no big deal. Is there a tool that will tell you exactly yeah, how high it's hitting? Tester. Okay, it's just a tester, yep. and it tells yep. you specifically. As a matter of fact, it was the tester that came with my Premier One fence. Oh, okay. Yep. Cool. Because, I mean, this looks beautiful. Like, you can see... Oh, yeah, that... 
Like look the, right there. The that, across the back. fence. Yeah, that's yeah. what it used to look like. And early now, this summer. yeah, this is gorgeous. Yep. This is awesome. It's yeah, because the back of our property, we've talked about fencing it. This but, area here. Mm hmm. <clears throat> This actually is probably fenced off. It goes around that way. Yeah. And it's probably another acre. Wow. And I know you can't tell. It still looks messy here. Yeah. This is a tornado came through here, believe it or not. Oh, really? Yeah, right when we moved here. Yeah. That's one of these trees are down. Okay. But um, this used to look terrible, and they have cleared it out big time. And they were only in here for about a month and a half. Oh, okay. Yeah. So that's awesome yeah, that this is working good enough we might have to give it a whirl trash that's collected mm -hmm. you see my trash <laughs> yeah well our house got hit by a tornado too and that's mm -hmm. what you don't think about is like in the back of our property there's so much trash yep. that you never realize it. until like we keep on finding parts of the neighbor's house because yeah. their house it got their whole house yeah the, these trees uh mm -hmm. there was like three or four trees we've already cleaned it up and then over there where we just were with the ponies mm -hmm. that pond when y'all drive out yeah. There, you'll probably see some trees down at that pond. It came straight through this way. Oh, wow. Yeah, it was only an F1. It wasn't very strong, but it what took was, out a lot of what trees. What was the one that came by our house? I think it was a three. Three? three. Yeah. Mm. Ours was about 90 to 120 mile an hour winds. Wow. Ours was. Yeah. Y'all's was probably, what, 120 to 150-ish? Uh, enough to take off the yeah. top of the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, and the barn and the vehicles. Yeah. But, wow. Wow. Mm -hmm. It's cool though how goats, how yeah, well they work. Yeah. That was from, from it. Wow. It looks gorgeous. Yeah, they've done a really good job. They've done a really nice. This would be so much easier than having to put up, put in the. Premier one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It works. You do. Well, I think bigger goats work better in it. Yeah. Um, and when they get hit, you got to make sure they get hit with that 8,000. Okay. I want to see your tester or send me a picture of your yeah, tester. Gonna, yeah. Yeah. Um, okay. If it if it doesn't if they get hit with it, mm -hmm. they'll always test it if it's not strong. Oh, okay. So it has, be, yeah, it has to be. It has to, be it has to nip them points. every time. Good. Yes. Okay. Good so to know. They just won't come back. All right. Awesome. Well, thanks, Mike, for taking yeah. us around and showing us your farm and taking care of syrup. Yeah, you're the third YouTube channel out here. Oh, really? I've had, yeah, I've had Eddie's and then uh, Eldridge. Eldridge. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, the Eddies and Eldridge, and they're fixing to have their twins. Yeah, I know. I can't yeah, that. that's, that's going to be exciting. Yeah. yeah. I appreciate you guys coming out, and I yeah. definitely appreciate y'all uh, letting us have the ponies for a little while, and then, uh, off, you know, obviously yeah. gifting us pancake. That pancake. was awesome. Yeah, Rai Rai. Rai Rai, I, Rai I, loves it. I saw yeah. the video with the uh, unicorn horn. Yep. Did you guys track it down? Uh, yes, we do have it. We have not shot the video yet. Not yet. Actually, okay. we, we actually tried. Okay. Pancake wouldn't have any part of it. Oh, He's really? Like, no, that's not going on my head. He's like, not for me. But I was real close, so I'm going to keep trying. Okay. I think I can get In it. In time. Yeah, In I think time. I can get it. I just don't want to yeah. spook him too much with it. Well, don't forget to shoot over to Fowler Family Farm. They're some of our friends, and we'd like you to like and subscribe and let them know that we sent them your way. Thank you, guys. Thank y'all. Have a great day. Hey, Take go two. ahead and check Take it. Two. Make sure it's facing the right way. Oh, yeah. You can edit that little part yeah. out. <laughs> All right. So Take two. Want, yeah, you want to keep that in for sure.